New Zealand's South Island gets all the glory. Most people will tell you the South Island is better than the North. This season, we're gonna show you why we have fallen in love with the North Island. Today, we head to the volcanic island of Ringi Toto, one of the most iconic landmarks in Auckland's city skyline. Our oldest son, Hobie, has been really into volcanoes. What I love about traveling is taking an interest and bringing it to the next level. Our first international trip with the kids, we traveled to Italy and made a special trip all the way down to Pompeii. We saw the famous Mount Vesuvius and visited the city that was buried by the big eruption over 2,000 years ago. In Samoa, we visited the island of Savai so we could see their lava flows. We even went to the small island of Tana to climb an active volcano. Visiting volcanic places is right up our alley. We're really excited to visit this volcanic island so close to home. Today we are headed to Rangi Toto Island. I think that's how you pronounce it, I don't know. But uh, yeah, it's a volcanic island, the, what is it, the newest volcano island, like 600 years old. Super excited, we're gonna go on a hike up to the top and then explore some caves. Somebody took a ride behind the ferry boat to Waikiki Island. What? Yeah. In like a kayak? In a hydrofoil. Nice. They made it all the way. Nice. We should try it. <laughs> okay. Alright. What time is it? It is 12.15. Where are we going? We're going to Rangi Toto. Rangi Toto. Why is Haley crying? She's tired. It's not. Hey boys, ready for a three hour tour? My passenger set sail that day for a three hour tour. A three hour tour. You bring enough snacks. Ringi Toto is the newest volcano in New Zealand, emerging from the sea just 600 years ago. Our goal is to climb the volcano and reach the summit. We also want to explore the lava caves. Time is a little tight. We only have until 5 p.m. I'm not sure what we would do if we got stuck on the island overnight. All the way to the top. Where the detour to the lava. All right, we're part way through the trail. The kids are taking a little break. They're getting tired. Um, we started uh, right there. And that's where we're at. It seemed like it was going to be a very long walk. The kids were already tired and needed a break just a few steps into the trail. Wish us luck. Really hoping we make it back to the ferry on time. All right, we made it to the first lava field of the day. Exploring. So the island's pretty cool. It's got all of these like lava rocks everywhere, like even along the shore and as you're hiking up to the summit. It's kind of neat. I can up. I can up. I can see the tower. You can see where we started. How do you hike with kids? You turn it into a game. 
The pipes are obstacles. So the hike really wasn't that bad. It wasn't too terribly steep. Plenty to look at and explore. Our biggest problem, we were going really slow. We were a bit worried about getting up and down before the ferry left. All right, we are walking to the top very slowly. We made a mistake by letting Callie think she can walk. And now she won't get in my pouch. Eventually, we were able to coax Hallie back into my pouch. We were able to pick up the pace just a little. Slowly but surely, we eventually made it. We made it to the top. Here we are. The sun is See what kind of views we get. What kind of views we get from the top. We get a tree. Mommy. Mommy the bird went under here. Oh. At the top, we saw these really cool birds with babies. Not sure what type of birds they were. Definitely not kiwi birds, but cute nonetheless. It was a bit of a cloudy day, but the view was still beautiful at the top. We didn't have time to stick around for too long at the top. We had to keep moving. We were still worried about making it back down in time to catch the ferry. You can see the ferry coming. We gotta make sure we get back for it. It's kinda crazy. When it comes to islands, we seem to run into a bit of bad luck. We were hoping we wouldn't have any bad luck this time. But in case we did get stuck on the island, we were scoping out some places we could sleep. There were some bunkers along the trail. It was kind of like the three bears. This one is too big. This one is too small. We needed to find one that was just right. I feel like I'm in Lost. Hello? This is where we're going to sleep tonight, guys. Yeah, this is probably our best spot. Best, best spot. We missed the ferry. See if you can close the door, Hobie. We'll sleep in here. Alright, that's pretty good. That should keep out all the snakes. Oh no! We're trapped! Oh no! Volcano Summit. We're gonna check out the uh, lava cave. Super excited about that. I just realized we forgot our flashlights, but I think we'll be okay because we have flashlights on our phones. So, and we have two of those. The boys went ahead and found something. Let's go see what it is. It's off the trail. All right, so we made it to the crater. This is probably the most dangerous spot of the volcano. Lava could come up at any moment. Um, how do you feel about that, Henry? Happy! He's so happy. I hope it doesn't erupt. Moana! Night night, Moana! It's warm because of the volcano. Yeah, they said it's gonna erupt tonight. We shouldn't be there. Every 600 years, Hobie. Yeah. 
Mr. Fairy. I'm not. Then I'm not. What do you see? Should have brought some rope. Oh wow! Be careful, guys. You did not see that coming. No, I did not see that coming. That's super cool. What do you think, Callie? Mom, that's the way out. Okay. Yeah, but it's not. It's made from the lava. Mommy, is this a lava cave? Yeah. Mom, we got a little lava. Is it getting a little low for you, Chris? Good job, Hallie. Keep going, keep going. Go! So, we've had a great time, but our fears are becoming a reality. We are running really short on time. It's like a huge cave. So, children, keep going. What's in here? Oh, yeah. 420, we have 40 minutes to get to where we need to go. Otherwise, the ferry leaves. Last ferry leaves at 5. We gotta go. So, it was 40 minutes before the ferry was due to leave. The trail says it takes 40 minutes for an average adult to get back. Not sure if we're gonna make it. It is 5 o'clock on the dot. The ferry is leaving like not even a second afterwards. I'm so thankful that we made it on time. So if you ever come to Rangitoto Island, make sure you get back to the ferry before 5 o'clock. All right, so we had a good time. We made it to the summit and we had a pretty good view up there. It was a pretty good hike for us to get ready for the South Island. Now we're heading back to Auckland. Join us next time as we welcome family to New Zealand. We share in some great adventures together, and I am going to share one of his most embarrassing childhood moments. Please subscribe so we can take you on our next adventure. Click the notification bell so you don't miss an episode. This season is gonna be good.